All right, we're gonna see what your person is thinking about you. What are their thoughts and their feelings about my viewer? Okay, if this isn't this is an even number of cards, so I'm gonna put it like that, and then we're gonna see what this means. I'm going to say that this side is the feelings and this side is their thoughts on you. So to cover what they're thinking of you, they think that you're really able to move quickly and approach situations with a lot of, um, well, this is swords energy with air. You could have air in your chart. They could feel like you have things figured out already that you don't really need to fake it because you you got a good head on your shoulders you could be able to understand what what things are at a glance even though inside you're thinking that you have to figure things out you could maybe not realize how far you've come in being able to be in that energy and realize that you do have a nimble head on your shoulders what they're feeling about you this person could feel like like you um, need alone time, but because you are are kind of hesitant to approach a situation, but they see you as being strong in how far you've come and what you're motivated about. I think they th they believe you have your values clear in your head that you don't get too tied up in little things and that you really think through things before jumping in them it kind of seems to me like they have a kind of a crush on you from afar like they're letting you have your space. All right, <laughs> let's see what, why they're, what is it about you that makes them think that you're this person? And what is it about this person? What is it about you that makes this person feel the way they do about you? Any cards? Well, for starters, they see you as a really fun person. Like you guys could have an adventure that nobody else would or that you could connect on some level together where it's synergistic or it's peaceful for them and they don't have to think about how they're they're worried about their life it's kind of like it's a breath of fresh air or a weight off of their shoulders to spend time with you and to think about um what you guys have going together rather than think about some of the some of the ways that they feel lost and the reason they think that you're such a nibble mover that you've got things figured out is because of the ten of pentacles and the world you could travel a lot 
perhaps you just seem like the family person like you would be good with kids You don't necessarily have to have everything figured out to be good in a family sit setting, but you have to know enough to be able to show little kids, here's the whole world around you, and at the same time be nurturing and set a good example by knowing what you want or how you're going to respond to a situation in order to teach them I think this person sees you as that kind of person I like the way the cards came out today it's very clean and organized some more thoughts on these two I've been gone for a few days at my parents' house. Tarot is a personal thing. I, I'd i like to share with you, but not necessarily my family. Funny enough, my, my mom gave me this deck and it's become super special to me um, ever since because I have a thing with animals, I guess. I'm thinking to change the uh, the theme of this channel into an animal theme. I've been making these candles and I've been finding some little animal things and I've been turning them into candles. So later on you're going to be able to buy candles like this on Instagram and like that. Like I said, I don't give personals, but I will do that and I give free extendeds here on YouTube. So the last message that's coming through here is the Wheel of Fortune and the Temperance. This relationship is good for both of you with, if it's incorporated with patience. And through time, things are going to mend or bring you two together. And I'm feeling a really like peaceful energy here. It's like... It's like hiking and finding a magic waterfall with a portal underneath it that goes wherever you want to go, where there's no time, where there's food and it's sunny or rainy, whatever you like, uh, you know, your type of weather. Uh, let me get a fortune for you. I'll leave a lot of this up to interpretation, but... I feel like this is about a relationship. This person, all these fortunes keep falling out. A light heart carries you through at hard times. Awaken your divine nature within. All right, like I said in the first half of my reading, I feel like you could be stressing a lot and trying to think through perhaps every possible scenario. Um, I heard something interesting yesterday that living in the future is it brings anxiety and living in the past brings depression living in the present brings happiness and it says a light heart carries you through all the hard times I think if you incorporate patience and realize that there is a good love between your person that they think higher of you than you might think. It could change things for you. you know? So tune in next week for more answers. Um, I'll probably post a reading over the weekend. If you have any specific questions, you can put them in the comments. And I will ask them and talk about them in my readings by pulling cards just for you. So drop a comment on that. I would love to hear what you want me to ask. Otherwise, I'll come up with some questions and meet you here next time. Thanks.